All right. Why are we doing this? You're on the internet. Is this gonna be on the Twitter? I mean, it it goes out to Twitter, yeah. Like immediately, or what happens? Yeah, it's like it's live now. I need my um, new sticker. Where is it? You had it. I took it. I put it over there. I'm gonna save it. Hmm. It made me feel special. You piss off every uh, uh, person that served drinks there tonight. No, the one lady loved me. Oh, the St. Patrick's girl? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah, she wanted No, to be, she didn't. She wanted to be wife number four, I could tell. Oh. She read my poem. You had a poem? She made, she made up a word. What? Palmistry. What are you talking about? Did you hear her say that? She was reading her poems? Oh, yeah, that was weird. She said palmistry. Palm, that's not a word. It's like dentistry, but with palms. Right. She, I don't think you were there, but she said I was going to die in a car crash. Oh, God. That I was hope. nice. Well, you never leave your house, so that's probably never going to happen. Well, the car could crash into my house. Does an Uber count since you're going to the balloon? <laughs> Call it Uber. There's some crazy Uber person that just drives right into your house. Crazy Uber person. Oh, Lord. What are you doing this for? Uh, I don't know. We're both drunk and tired. Some wildlife documentary of Tired Paul. I mean, I talk a lot about uh, how you are when you're drunk post bars, and I just like to kind of document these things. Yeah, people should see this. It, it really is it's, fantastic. This is important stuff. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> all I can think about is being asleep right now. Hey, okay, I saw someone ask here on the Periscope, explain why the way I watch television is wrong. Because here's the way TV is supposed to work. Okay. You got a thing in your hand with a remote. You get a big TV screen. Yep. You're just supposed to go boom, turn it on, and then stuff shows up, and then you can select from stuff. You shouldn't have to get on your computer and go boop, 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 boop. <laughs> look for I gotta go to Hulu.com and then do a thing. You can get, you know there's like apps on like Xbox and PlayStation. You just press the button and then you just watch the shit you want to watch. That's not a thing you do. Okay. It's just not the way the good Lord intended to work. <laughs> it's a devoutly religious Paul Riker. <laughs> That's right. Oh, oh you're dumb. I could, you know what I could do? What? One button. Oh, impress everyone on the internet, please. No, no I'm going to simulate it. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I need to put a caption underneath this here. This is where I run. <laughs> okay. Just boom. The TV would come on. And then there'd be like channels and stuff. Yeah. You watch whatever you want to watch. Or what if I just pressed a button and then said, hey, I want to watch the new SNL. And then I click that button and then I watch it. No, that's like 12 steps. This that's is two. Steps. This is two steps right here. Watch this. I'm going to actually, this is not dry run anymore. Oh my God, this is live? Holy shit, I got to wake up here. Hang on. Hang on. This is a groundbreaking. Groundbreaking. <laughs> This is like when that guy jumped out of the uh, the orbit thing and did the, the... I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Remember the guy did a live thing he jumped out of the spaceship? Oh, with the uh, space capsule hat? Yeah. yeah. Right? It was like a super high up thing and he had and to he jump through the atmosphere. Yeah, but he was cooler than us and he did. He, and lived. he, had, he had a really attractive lady with him on the ground. I don't remember that. that was, oh, weird. That's the thing that you got hung up on. <laughs> God. I just wear a space helmet and jump out of stuff. <laughs> Look You'll get on that. And look, there's a guide. Oh. Hey, remember how we're supposed to get up in five hours and play football? <laughs> That's clearly not going to happen. I'm going to piss you off so much tomorrow morning to make that happen. Somehow we, we got talked into playing touch football tomorrow at like nine in the morning. With uh, your friend. ex roommate slash best friend slash father of my sister's Step slash second ex husband of my mother. <coughs> What do you, you see all the choices? Yes, I remember this from 1997. There's no mouse involved. I, mm. Wait, 99 pound teens do what? 99 pound what? What? I can't. Balls deep in my. Oh, I can't. This is not left on Periscope. I gotta see the full title. Oh, this is like when you show Danny O'Dwyer space porn. <laughs> oh my god, look at this title. I can't. I, here, I'll look, but the phone can't look. Periscope can't see. Tiny, what the fuck? <laughs> Don't buy that. Say it out loud. That's, that sounds terrible. That sounds awful. That sounds actually illegal. <laughs> Don't click that button. Good lord. <sighs> Daughter. Ball, <laughs> ball, balls deep inside dirty moms? Yeah, that sounds about right. Please lick my. Holy lord. <laughs> Good lord. It's almost a. Wow, that's some messed up titles. <laughs> There anyway, yes, we're supposed to play uh, touch football tomorrow, but it's not going to happen. What? No, we're going to. Big Dan Lewis. Look at 
Look at this one. What, what are we looking at? Look at one I just uh, Highlight. Baby babysitter and her BFF banged a dirty dong. <laughs> so what? It creams. What does that mean? Good lord. What are we talking about there? That's when you have the holy conception thing where the Jesus wants you to have a baby. Oh, okay, gotcha. <sighs> to summarize tonight, I was a big baby about going where we went. Oh, you were the worst big baby. Because it was like a stereotypical corporate sports bar? It was just a fucking bar that you didn't go to. The lights were too bright and they didn't play Skinner. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> they had surfboards on the wall. But it worked out right. Your mom was there and your sisters were there. And a bunch of guys with beards showed up for some reason. <laughs> I have a beard. Eh. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> you don't have a real beard. <laughs> and somehow, my ass is wet right now as we speak. Do you remember why? Because you're dumbass. Because you're 12, poured a pitcher of water down my, my butt. No, because I was wearing my giant bum hoodie, and you came up and you put a full glass of beer in my fucking hood. No, I didn't. Was it, or was it water? That's not fair. I what? Wouldn't, I wouldn't do that to you. Yes, you did. Yeah. And I reached back, and it spilled all over the back of my neck, and I was like, well, fuck him. And so I grabbed a pitcher of water, and I grabbed the back of your jeans and pulled it open, and I pulled, poured the water down your butt crack. In a related story, we're 12. Let me, let, me, let me tell you a story about this chair. Okay. If this chair was like your generation, you'd have to dial up the internet and get like a space thing up there involved. But <laughs> no, I have this handy dandy thing, and I can just push this, and it goes up and down. Have you seen me try to pull up a thing on, on uh, the Hulu? You see how that works? How long do you think it takes me to fucking pull up a show on Hulu? Simple, efficient. And if I want to watch TV... I can just hit my handy dandy guide here and just do a thing. I don't have to dial up the internet. I don't have to wait for a second. Dial up the internet. <laughs> that's dial what, up the internet. That's what you do. I got to call the 56K modem AOL thing. I got to put in my disc. Look at all these choices. Well, on the internet, you can only go to one specific site to watch stupid stuff. You have no idea what you're talking about. I totally know what I'm talking about. Here, I can uh. just hit one button and it literally goes through like 10 things. And I can select a thing and watch TV like the good Lord intended to be. <laughs> the fuck are you talking about? This is how TV is supposed to be. I, my computer is always hooked up to my TV. The way you kids do it is stupid and weird. That's the millennials. I'm 32. You're still a millennial. I, I think maybe I'm technically in that whatever thing. Upper, but that's upper, stupid anyway. You're on the upper end of it. Yeah. For sure. Oh, God. But this is how you watch TV, kids. You pay $160 a month. That's right. And you know what? And I pay like 10 you know for Hulu Plus. You know what? It's worth it. No, it's not, you idiot. So you can just turn on your TV. You don't have to fire up your Googles. <laughs> you got to warm them up. <laughs> yeah, two days ahead of time, you got to warm up the Googles. God damn it. Jimmy Hendrix is the last hours. Let's take a shot. Oh, great idea. For the Periscope. Let's do it. No, I'm going to bed. Oh, you dumbass. You should see all the hearts we're getting on the Periscope. Is that right? All these millennials Who's love that? what we're doing. That's because their Hulu's not working and they can't watch TV. Their Hulu's not working. <laughs> it's always works fine. Their Hulu's not working so they can't watch TV. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all their hearts. I said they're giving hearts and now I'm getting a billion hearts. Their Hulu's not working. They can't watch TV. What am I going to do now? The TV's not working because the Hulu's broken. <laughs> What do you do? You get on your phone and you see what dumbass Dan Record's doing. <laughs> What's his fat ass doing? You're way fatter than me. You're all jowly now. I'm, I'm like 30 years older than you. I know, but you're jowly. I've earned my jowls. <laughs> this is like a Boy Scout medal. <laughs> That's right, I got, I got the badge. Got I got the jowl, jowl badge. badge. That's right. Oh, god damn it. I'm working on my erectile dysfunction badge. <laughs> What's the badge look like? What's the icon? The it, just, it just sags off the end of your shoulder. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, there's that Mila Kunis lady. Is that her name? <laughs> what? Yes, I guess. And she's something. I don't even like whiskey. But, <laughs> but I would drink it because of that Jim Beam commercial she does. Oh, where she's hanging out with she's, barrels? She's walking around in a warehouse there with a stick or whatever. <laughs> Just pointing at barrels. <laughs> Is that what the 70s show was about? That's really what she does. I never saw it. 
Have you seen the commercials? Yeah, not really. I don't see commercials because I'm on the Hulu. She doesn't even drink whiskey. She like drinks like water, and then she has a thing of wine, and what? then she goes and blows Ashton Kutcher or something. Are they dating? They're married, aren't they? Really? They I thought married. he was with Demi Moore. No. No? No. No more? You're way behind the times. <laughs> no, she walks around uh, 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 whiskey warehouses. <laughs> That's her job. And points and barrels. And then she has sex with Ashton Kutcher. And then somebody's pranked and they have a baby. Oh, chat, chat is saying that uh, they are married and have kids. They just have exactly. a new kid. Yeah. I'm on top of this Hollywood stuff. <laughs> We're so not playing football in the morning. Yes, we are. Mm, I don't see it happening. Hey, let's, let's have a drink. Really? Yeah. Does the For the Periscope. Does the internet demand it? I'll see. I'll, here, I'll ask. Uh, do, do some hearts and chat stuff. This is simultaneous. <clears throat> Oh, now there's a lady doing a thing. Okay, this is going to be... Simultaneously the best and worst product name I've ever seen. Have you seen it? The Hurricane? No, what does it do? It's for old people and it has like, instead of like a one-prong thing at the end, it has like three prongs. Hurricane? It's, it's literally called the Hurricane. It's spelled just like you would think. I, I don't understand it. Even though old people never hurry. Here's the, here's the, hey, here's the people on the Periscope. Look at them. Here's all these millennials. Oh! Uh, this. Their Hulus are broken. Now, several people said they were watching Hulu before they came on here. Nah, they're not doing that. That's not a thing you do. Let's come do a drinky thing. All right, we'll do one. All right, we'll do one. What are you doing, your fireball thing? Fireball, yeah. Okay. Oh, I got to think of this show. I'm always touching my balls. Somebody has to. Nah, I'm engaged. Here's. <laughs> let's give a tour. Jesus Christ, it's what are you doing? <laughs> oh, look how ashamed he is. Lunatic. Hey, it's too late now, Dad. It's too, let, me, let me show it. Let me show it to the people. I'm going to punch you in the face. No. Seriously, I'm going to punch you in the face. <laughs> oh, shut up. I fucking tweeted this. Over here. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jesus. Holy crap. What was that? What? Oh, I thought it was a bug. <laughs> It's a pubic hair attached it's to it. It's just a fucking thing of lint. No, look, it's a pubic hair attached to it. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> anyway. Why are we doing this? We're going to feel like even more shit than we did in the morning. I'll be fine. I, I drank water at the bar, but you made fun of me for being a San Francisco fancy guy that uh, had a... Uh... Yeah, you've changed. Because <laughs> I ordered water with my 9,000 beers. You used to be drinking water tonight? No, because you're stupid. No, because because I'm from good stock. I'm from the Midwest. <laughs> you you're not from good stock. You take fucking two hours to wake up every morning. Is that right? Yes. What's the court? The, the chat wants to see your fridge. Can we see your fridge? Nah, chats are stupid. Okay. Your bathtub or your fridge? Shut up. You're not seeing either. <laughs> Quit touching your stuff. <laughs> all right, let's do a thing. Oh, I got to do a thing. All right. All right, all right here's to all you millennial who will look. <laughs> Go on. Hulu Millennials. That's really That's what we call ourselves. <laughs> Hulu Millennials. That's, that's an overlooked demographic in the election. <laughs> the Hulu Millennials. There we go. That's All right. super hard to say. All right, there we go. Cheers, kids. Don't be like us. <sighs> that's good. Yeah, it is. Do you guys know the heebie nutter flutters? Heebie nutter flutters? Where are they? Oh, double stuffs? They're great. Oh, yeah, these are good. The oh, here's your fucking apron you stole. I got the candy cane. I didn't steal it. Yes, you did. You're misrepresenting. You weren't supposed to keep that. The, the, the uh, leprechaun lady that was a waitress there who liked me gave this to me. What's it say? 360. Oh, it's upside down. Oh, it's a giveaway. That's no, really good okay. Oh, but here you guys have this. What? No, oh, all right. <laughs> that was an excuse for all my behavior tonight. That's how that all started. Listen, dude, didn't, didn't you say that you frequently eat like an entire package of these? I've, I've been known to do that. Yeah. That's insane to me. It's like, like, I'm a, I love eating like a big fat guy, but. Hey, Hulu Millennials, this is a VHS copy of Dan Riker, Dirty Dan Riker's first <laughs> birthday party. Yeah. Call me by my gimmick. <laughs> I demand that. Of his first birthday party, and actually, it's, I, I can't wait to see this. I don't have a VCR player. We had to find a VCR. He was Danny back then. Mm -hmm. That was his covert CIA name. <laughs> you were Sesame Street. I love Sesame Street. You were, yeah, I taped. You know what I did for you? What? 
I knew there's certain parts of Sesame Street that you liked. You like the aliens you liked a lot. Oh, the door. Yeah, yeah. They were great. Yeah. I taped all the parts you liked. Oh. I would sit there diligently with no pants on. What? I don't know. What's that necessary? That was for me. I would just tape the parts you liked. Wasn't I way into like that Van Halen thing? Oh, California Girls. Yeah, when I was like a baby. It was so weird. You could be in a adolescent tirade just crying like a lunatic. And if that video came on, it was like the switch went off and you would turn and watch the TV and watch it. The David Lee Ross solo thing? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, and I liked it for different reasons. Boner stuff? Boner stuff. <laughs> Just for the record, my refrigerator has issues. It's not that bad. I'm tweeting the picture. Can we just show it? Because the wine punch thing went crazy in the lid fell off. Two years ago. <laughs> it's more like five. <laughs> but the wine punch lid came off, so a bunch of wine punch went crazy and it spilt all over it, so it looks like I killed a caribou or something. So people know the story now, so what do you have to be Okay, let's do it. Give it to her. Give it to her. It's MDB Cribs here. Here we go. I cleaned this. Hey, up. wait, 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 let's see just what you have here. We got blue bonnet. We got uh, the Pepsi's and the Five Hour Energy uh, and Seven Ups. Taco, oh, Taco Bell, Brandon. Okay, I can't argue with that. This, this isn't that far from. You don't have that much to be ashamed of. Well, this is pretty bad. But my punch fell down. Okay, so we got that. That's been that way for a few so, years. It's all normal guy stuff. <laughs> normal guy stuff. It is. Yeah. Okay. We got the Fireballs. That, like, it's not that bad. It's just the fact that you're so self-conscious about it. That's weird to me. Yeah. Oh, Patron? That seems very fancy for you. Yeah, there's a reason. Here's your water bottles that you've reused for two years that you freak out whenever I drink from because... The, the Patron is here because of a lady. Oh, you had a lady that was into it. Okay. Five years ago. Okay, you got your milk. We got our leftover Mexican. This is fascinating for the whole of the Jeez, And people demand it. You got, you got your fruit cups? Oh, during break in fifth grade. All right. All right. All right. This, see, it's not that bad. It really isn't that bad. All right. I have no shame in my freezer. You shouldn't. Great, great Merle Haggard song. <laughs> oh, wait. What's going on? Wait. Is this what the party pizza packages are like? Yeah, they changed. They totally changed it. They're not circular? It's the same amount of pizza. Oh, no, it, it is the same amount. They did say that. All, All right. right. Hey, Lulu people. I bought this specifically because I knew Dan was going to be here. And this seems like a Dana Riker kind of thing. Can we do that now? Nope. Can we do that before I leave? Yeah. And I'll be back for Christmas. Right too. after football. You know I'm here for like 10 Are days. Are you getting the inside of my nostrils? Are okay. you? Okay. Okay. <laughs> what, am I, what am I, the dentist? Uh, what is I, going I, on just, here? Just, 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 look at the light. Look at the light. <laughs> <laughs> You're an idiot. I want to go to bed. Oh, oh, you got this. All right. Oh, it's got a rubber band. That seems like a lot when I only have one hand to work with. Yeah, uh, masturbation joke. <laughs> You're good. There's dumb stuff I would need to like. Do you have any kazoos? I have like 8,000 plastic bags. <laughs> Holy crap, what's going on here? Oh, here's something. Do you have any Starcoy cups? No, I do actually. <laughs> here though, here's proof. You've always suspected this? What is this? Oh, yeah, yeah, it's probably true. Yeah, it mm -hmm. is probably true. Actually, my daughters give that to me. Oh, yeah. They love me. They're great. Wait, what's going on up here? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, no, no, no. Hang on. I don't know if some parents go can show that. Hang on. Sorry. Sorry. That's, that's not, not appropriate. Speed Paul is against the terms and conditions. Oh. <laughs> no, no, Dad, Dad, you can't do it. Too much cool? It's too much. It's too much. It's, too much. it's cool. gonna break my phone, Dad. It's, it's gonna. It's gonna break my phone. It's too much cool. Yeah. Oh, if you had a zipper right now, it'd be the worst. Private joke. <laughs> All right. Oh, can't show it. Can't show it. I'll show. I'll just film the spider for a while. What the hell is this? I've never even seen these before. What the hell is that? I have no idea where those came from. Here's a Midwest thing. What? Farm jam. 2014. What is Farm Jam? Uh, it's a bunch of people uh, getting drunk on a farm. All right. I sent you pictures of that. Remember, I would send you pictures of me by these big farm equipment things. And saying, "Here's another thing I don't understand." 
That sounds about right. Yeah, it's like a combine or a thresher or something. <laughs> mm. Do you see our farming simulator? Quick look. Did we do that? No, me and Jeff. And the farming, the combine. Oh, I did. You had no idea what you were talking about. Hey, we're farm people. We know. I'm looking for a Star Quest cup. Star Quest. Oh. Oh, I just had one break, so uh, the amount of these in the wild has actually gone down. Are these legendary yet? They, I think we've talked about them enough. Danny O'Dwyer keeps his in a china cabinet. <laughs> and I'm asking, like, that's all I want for Christmas, Dad? Just give me a bunch more Starquake cups. I know we have. We're sitting on a Fort Knox of those. Does it keep it right next to potatoes? I think so, yeah. Oh, this is... Uh, Hang on. I, I, need to, I feel like we, we didn't give the Star Quick Cup enough uh, love here. This is the thing that me and Danny O'Dwyer talked about. This is the most legendary thing that any Rikert... <laughs> if you go to any Rikert's house... It's our legacy. It's the 125th anniversary of Lenexa, Kansas. They had a Star Quake in Old Town Lenexa. It was crazy. Then we had a billion of these cups, and then at the end they made way too many... And his father and my grandpa... My thrifty grandpa. You're my thrifty father. <laughs> took a billion of them, and we all have uh, way too many of those. We distributed them amongst the family. These things, I still don't know what they are. But they it looks are, like gum. They technically belong to your mother. Oh, are those wax things they put in the candle thing? You, you shipped something here that was supposed to go to your mother or something? Oh, yeah. Remember? I bought her Christmas. And that was in the thing. Yeah. This was for her. Here's me hmm. being extremely cheap. My sister had these. So like <laughs> post-it note things. Okay. I literally have like twelve of them up there. It's just blank post-it note things. Yeah. And I'll never use them. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Oh boy, there's stuff going on up here. What are you doing? Maybe another eel, whatever. Uh, I got spices and sauces and stuff. That's good. So when I bought a crock pot, I decided I was going to do something with that. Do you ever get the Chipotle ranch stuff? That's really good. What are you talking about? It's like it's like that, but it's got Chipotle. It's got a spice to it. Like a dressing? Yeah. That's nah, a San Francisco fancy thing. That's what it is. That's all you do now. Mm-hmm. Fancy sauces. <laughs> uh, you need to get my pops in there. That's it? That was a good man right there. Yes, he was. Way better than us. Oh, yeah. That's for sure. Anyway, that's about it. I need to go to sleep. Okay. Because I got football to play in the morning. <laughs> I'll wake up in five hours. Some strenuous touch football. We're going to show up and surprise people. You're going to wear pajama pants? Mm -hmm. That's my plan. I'm going to wear no pants. Okay. It's touch football. Uh, anyway. <laughs> <clears throat> I need to go to sleep because I'm really tired. Okay. I'll just family sleep for a few hours for a periscope. Your mouth's full of double stuff. <laughs> what? <laughs> this was a great trip. I actually went to Paris. No, yeah. I can't picture you in Paris. Oh, it was fun. Mm. They hated me there. Weird. <laughs> <laughs> I could never guess that. Actually, after about two days, I thought I could speak French. <laughs> That's about right. <laughs> yeah. The cab drivers hated me. <laughs> All right, you go sleep. Okay, you want to bed? Mm -hmm. I got to pee and stuff. All right, sir. Okay. I'm good at flushing your toilet now. You've actually, the last couple of times you've actually done it correctly. Yeah. Is this going on the Twitter? No, that's on the Periscope now. I don't even know how you, how, how do you access that? You press a button and you press another button. But how do people know to do that? How do they you know? Just, you just look at the thing for two seconds and figure it out. But how is someone notified that this is available? Like There's a notification on their phone that shows up and says, hey, this person's live right now. Or do they have to follow you or something? On Periscope. Let's go outside and smoke. Okay, can I pee first? You can smoke. Here, will you take my phone while I pee? And you can talk to the people? Alright, I'm having trouble with my slippers. Oh. Here, okay, wait, hang on, we gotta do this. Just don't do anything that's gonna get me in trouble. I wanna pee. You're right, I'm really jowly and pale. Yeah, I love how you call me fat for the last eight years and I said you were jowly and then you got mad about it. Yeah, but I've earned my jowliness. No. <laughs> Is jelliness a word? Yeah, probably. I want to pee. I'll be out there. I'll smoke a cigarette with you. There you are. Why not? You guys still watching, really? What? Hearts are good, right? Hearts? Yeah. What are you talking about? There's all kinds of hearts going on here. Oh, yeah, hearts are good.
Sure, I guess. Do the different colors mean something different? No, none of it means anything. I need my reading glasses. Turn on your porch light. What are you, Neil Diamond? What? That was an E.T. reference. No. Turn on your porch light. Oh, don't shut the door. What? Oh, wow. just locked our ass out. Okay. Anyway, we're outside now at Shea Paul. Shea Paul? Is that how you say it? What? House of uh, Shea. Is that a French thing? C-H-E-Z. It'd be Casa de Paul if it That's was Spanish. Spanish. I don't know French. Shea, uh, how, Shea Paul means House of Paul. Chateau? You're an idiot. I just know Spanish. You don't even know Spanish. I don't know. Vaping is better. I don't think so. We saw a guy with a robot... Vaping thing. The vaping seems way bigger here than it was in uh, in San Francisco. Vaping is the thing there, but the, man, vaping shops are everywhere here. I've noticed that. Chateau. Chateau. That's what I said. Yeah, but this guy's smarter than you. Yeah, that's probably true. <laughs> Odds are good that he's way smarter than you. <laughs> I, I've smoked a few cigars. I'm answering a guy's question. Okay. I've, uh, I've, had, I've smoked a few cigars in my life. Little, um, what do they call those? I have no idea. Little smoky, not little smokies. <laughs> fucking barbecue sauce. Sweet, thing. what do they call them? Sweet something. Somebody help me out. Cigarillos? Anybody know what I'm talking about? They're like they have. They're like cigars, but they have a plastic tip on them. I have no idea. I don't smoke. It's cigarillos. I don't smoke. Help me, Hulu people. It's not Hulu. Swisher Sweets. Swisher Sweets. That's it. <laughs> really? Whoever that guy was. Who was that guy? Uh, like a bunch of people. Swisher Sweets was correct. Turns out, Swisher Sweets is really hard to say. <laughs> After about 1977. <laughs> God, I hope I never have to get a real job because stuff like this is going to show up, isn't it? Yeah, I, I've been in your basement. There's a lot more <laughs> swim studio shoes and Playboys down there. There's more damning stuff? No, it's just a bunch of Playboys and shit. When you go for a job, they don't come into your basement and look around. <laughs> They'll get to search the periscopes. What, what are all these people doing awake at this time of night? Some of them might be European. That's true. But they could yes. be on the West Coast because it's like 2 o'clock there. Uh, what time is it? Two? Yeah, some West Coast people might be like near the end of the bar thing. And then uh, uh, European people might be in the beginning of their day. There's a New Zealand guy. Mm -hmm. He's chasing sheep around and holding his phone with one hand. That's what they do. That's all they do. Dallas. We got a Dallas. We got an Illinois. I've seen, Arizona, I've West seen, Coast. I've seen Fly the Concords. That's what they do. <laughs> that's, that's, that's it. East Coast. All right, yeah. People from all around here. Houston, UK. It's 8.30 in the morning in the UK. You're Hello, yelling. UK. You're yelling. Oh, no. People with jobs are sleeping. Oh, I don't want to wake up your hot neighbor. <laughs> She's awake. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Is this seriously this the same person still? Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> you were so embarrassed about that. Mm -hmm. Oregon, Arizona. Florida. So mostly West Coast. Some of them are. Nebraska. No, they get plenty around here. Bunch of damn alcoholics is what they are. Mm hmm Man. Look at you. <laughs> uh, everybody see the picture of Amish Dan on the Twitter? That's one thing about old people. They insert the word the in front of everything. And the Google. The, the Google. Yeah. The internet. Yeah, I think half of the time you do it to be funny and half the time you just do it because they're old. You're mean. Oh, yeah. I can't wait. I just want to live to be like 75 so I can see you be 54. Because you're going to be confused and frightened about everything. No, I work in this. I, my job is to keep up to date with the stuff like you this. You can't keep this job up forever. No, I don't think I'll always Somebody, be Somebody, David Letterman's going to catch on to what you're up to at CBS. <laughs> yeah, he's the boss. Him and his beard. Are like, Why are we paying this dumbass to sit on a couch and drink beer and talk about Zelda? <laughs> What the hell? Why is this happening? <laughs> I think it's, it's Cold Perry and Alcom. <laughs> taking over. He's my new boss. It's Cold Perry Alcom. What'd you say? <laughs> Never mind. Well, you're just holding the cigarette right in my face. Fuck you. Why is there werewolves here? <laughs> okay, oh, share where I was frightened by a bunny. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's uh, I'll do a switch around here. So I sit here. Hang on. Is it switch around? What's happening? Nothing's happening. Wait, what? 
Hang on. There we go. Nope, that's fine. For you millennials that don't know how fall works, the leaves fall down and shit here in the Midwest. So I sit here and smoke on my porch a lot. So obviously the ground is covered by leaves. And every once in a while, I'll hear a crinkly, crinkly sound. And it frightens me because I'm pretty sure that somebody's going to come around the corner and stab me. And it turns out to be a rabbit. That's not a great story. It's a good story. It's no, it's really not. It scares me every time. <laughs> show, show my Google Fiber uh, things. Marks on the ground that we can't see at all. I'm actually kind of uh, impressed that you're willing to uh, give it a shot. I signed up for like three years ago. Really? And they're just now installing the cables. That's actually kind of smart. Meh. I can't wait. <sighs> I cast out the periscope and then we can uh, just go, go to sleep. bed or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, let these werewolves do their thing. There are a lot of werewolves, werewolves in this neighborhood. <laughs> Learn. Do you remember? You used to live here. Uh, yeah, I lived here for two years. Two years, yeah. Yep. I can still smell the stupid in the house, too. There are still remnants. Remnants of stupid. Mm hmm All right, good night, Periscope. All right, good night, folks. Go back to your Hulu. Yep. <laughs> yeah.